Hi friends, what's up? This is our Carephone 360 Reader. It's time to learn how to remove passwords from pages, numbers, and keynote files from iPhone or iPad. Do you need to remove a password from an iWork document? Do you find it inconvenient to open password protected pages, keynote, and numbers documents? Do you no longer need password protection on a particular iWork file? Don't worry, because there is a pretty easy way to remove passwords from pages, numbers, and keynote files from iPhone or iPad. Let me show you how it's done the right way. Before getting started, make sure you have subscribed our YouTube channel and hit the bell icon so that you won't miss any update from 360 Reader. First and foremost, open the Pages app on your iPhone or iPad. After that, tap on the encrypted document to open it. When you are prompted to enter the password, type in the details and then tap on done to continue. After the document opens, you will typically be in the reading view. To enter the editing mode, you need to tap on edit. If you are already in the editing mode with a bunch of tools showing up at the top, you can skip this step. Now you have to tap on the triple dot icon as shown here to access more options for the selected document. In this menu, you have to scroll down and tap on change password to manage the password settings for the document. After that, you have to set the toggle for require password to disabled. Now you have to enter the document's password again to make these changes. Now simply type the password and tap on done to remove the encryption and you are good to go. That's all there is to it. You have managed to remove the password from an encrypted document for quick and easy access on your iPhone or iPad. You can now follow these steps to change the password for your document too, whether it's pages, keynote or numbers. If your only reason for removing the password is inconvenience, you can enable the option to use Face ID in the Change Password menu if it wasn't enabled already. We get that Face ID isn't available on Macs, but you can enable the option to remember your password in Keychain while setting up the password if you prefer. That's all for now. If you found this video helpful, do like and share it and I'll see you in the next video with more such handy tips. And stay safe and have a great time. Bye-bye.